training here at the Brisbane Heavy Hitter Club. Our first session after the big weekend. Hey guys, uh, not sure what I'm up to today exactly, uh, sorting out a few things with work and all that sort of stuff, but I'm uh, pretty tired still from the, um, from the weekend. Training tonight though at the Brisbane Heavy Hitter, so that'll be good. Um, but other than that, just pushing forward on everything I'm doing, keep creating content, keep having good times, and yeah, plenty of arm wrestling. Just loaded the uh, table into the car to take the train tonight. Um, thanks to Tom Lou Glacier for bringing those over for the, for the tournament, mate. But um, I know what it is every time I go to a tournament. I lose straps. I don't know. They go and walk about. Anyway, hopefully they turn up, but anyway, arm wrestling straps. They disappear. So sitting here, just about to go in and do some work with another business in my local town with some videography. And, um, oh, I think it's I'm all sort of crashing down energy-wise, both sort of physically, mentally, everything. Just kind of falling in a heap after the big weekend. But um, pushing forward, definitely going to push forward either way and uh, move onwards and upwards. Look for the next project. I've got to identify what that's going to be, but. Um, Hey, on another note, my dad wants to go into the 80 kilos class for nationals. Uh, I think if he does that, he could he could win it. To be honest, he's got a hand and wrist that could uh, really muck up all those 80 kilo guys. Um, and and uh, yeah, you never know. Take the gold potentially. But anyway, um, gonna keep pushing on. So I just did some thinking about some content moving forward for the channel, and I reckon one of the things I'm gonna do is um, I'm gonna do like a Ryan Bowen versus whatever sort of thing. So I'm going to go, first one I'm going to do is I think with the Brazilian Jiu Jitsu Club in my local area, I'm going to put myself through the, through the ropes with a local black belt and uh, get my ass handed to me. Uh, but it'll be a bit of fun and I've also got an opportunity with um, one of the bench press record holders in the country as well. I'll do a session with him but um, that'll get the, the ball rolling and uh, yeah we'll see where that one goes from there. But that uh, should be a bit of fun. Uh, that should all, that should do I reckon. Perfect, that's fine. Thank thanks, thanks very much. So wait till you see who I'm about to pick up to take training at the Brisbane Heavy Hitters. You might be surprised. Look who's coming to training. This bloke. <laughs> we're going to see if he can be the first person in history to have two broken arms at the same time. So we're going to get the job done tonight. <laughs> Let's hope. Cool. Training here at the Brisbane Heavy Hitter Club. Our first session after the big weekend. Oh, there's Carlo, he's loving it. But it uh, feels good, the left arm feels strong. I wonder why, but anyway, the right arm's a bit tender. And uh, it's feeling good though, it's feeling good. Getting the blood back out. Grab the, grab the peg, Harley. You need to grab the peg, mate. Someone give me that peg to Guys, that's it for the day. Uh, it was a really good session at the Brisbane Heavy Hitters. Harley Jarrett going along with the busted arm. It was good just to see him back at the table and hanging out with the boys as well. So that was good and uh, it was hilarious. Tonight I was able to toy with Danny Tesh on left and he was absolutely toying with me on the right. Um, both, both of us obviously quite tender from our weekend match with Justin. Um, anyway, have a good one guys.